Hello and welcome to the most vast stadium in Andalusia, the Estadio Benito Villa Marín here in Seville. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And the focus is on one of the finest leagues in world football, La Liga. It's Real Betis versus Cadiz. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And here's the starting 11 for Real Betis. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated and it could be difficult for them. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, they're playing the same shape, really, so it's all about getting control of that central area and which of the wide players has the greatest effect on the game. And now they get the ball rolling. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. William Carvalho. Now with Perez. It's with William Carvalho. Miranda a chance maybe from the wide position and a useful cross a very effective clearance Perez must take the lead here there it is the first goal in the derby a special moment Here's the replay, and it's a brilliant turn to buy himself that bit of space. And then, of course, the finish. That's a great bit of play in the box. Back underway, 1-0 it is. Ruben Alcaraz. Effective looking pass. Nicely timed tackle. Sabali. Good looking sequence. Oh, Jose Perez! Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Played over. And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two goal lead now. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. And 
the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Theo von Gonda. That's useful play. That's a useful cross. Well, pretty straightforward for the keeper, you've got to say. Strong play here. A Jose Perez. Not a great pass. Escalante. Now Canales. A Jose Perez. And he stopped them in their tracks. Escalante. Ruben Alcaraz. Can they hit on the break? At times they make passing look easy. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Promising attack, this. Well, the stats show us that the hosts haven't had that much of the ball, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. Yes, and maybe another break brewing here. Well, that is how to play advantage. And the flag does go up. Must have been close. Approaching half-time on the home side, very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game, they've won their individual battles, and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. Chance here! Can they slot it home? And a goal at the second time of asking, but the keeper has let his team down. Well, as you can see, it's an error from the goalkeeper. You just can't spill it into a dangerous area like that. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Not a huge chunk of added time, one minute. A danger here as he runs at them. Happy to take on the shot. Well, flinging himself at it. Who's going to get on the end of it? And with that, the first half action comes to an end here at the Estadio Benito Villamarín. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. He's playing with real authority and attack, Stuart. Well, you won't see too many better performances than this. He's been an absolute menace to these defenders today. And of course, he's taken his goals really well. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Well, he really read that brilliantly. 
Perez. Unable to keep the ball that time. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Escalante. And reading it absolutely superbly. Breaking at pace. Do they have the guile to up and up the defence? Looked like an effective counter-attack, but brilliantly read. Alex Fernandez. Escalante with it. Can he make it count? And this time it's in! Fabulous goal! And just look at the celebrations. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. a tale of four goals in this match now three one it is Canales Yusuf Sabali with it possession and patience the watchwords takes the shot Made sure nothing came of that. Oh, could be. Well, it really wasn't a great effort, was it? Ruben Alcaraz. Teammates available. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Borja Iglesias. Oh, goodness me, off the post. Well, threat over for now. Well, they won't come much closer than that. It's a matter of inches from being a really good goal. Yes, so near indeed. But now they've got to concentrate on keeping their defensive shape. Clear foul play. And as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready. And now they will make the personnel change. And never in any doubt from the keeper. Well, a textbook interception. Borja Iglesias Miranda This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity Could be! Oh, commanding goalkeeping And it is substitution time at this juncture Not just from one side, but from both Let's see about the delivery. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. And making the move to the inside. But they took care of the situation defensively. 
We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Could play it in. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. And a spectacular contribution from Borja Iglesias, full of substance. What did you make of his performance, Stuart? Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.